Eleven riders came to Riga for the Suzuki Night of the Jumps. Big surprise was the comeback of Norway's Ilo Gaup, who had a 10-month absence from the IFMXF track. It's the first day of finals and sixth place, Bion Concini starts first, while favorite Remy will go last as he was best in qualifying. I'm happy, I'm in the final, sixth position, but sorry for Fabian in seven for only one point. Next time, Fabian, now watch my ramp. Massimo shows off a well-balanced mixture of difficult flips and stylish classic tricks. We just saw a double-handed heart attack followed by that super flip seat grab, a successful trick premiere from Massimo. He's happy and of course Massimo can take his rightful place on the hot seat as the current leader. Uh, qu quality was not uh, as I really want to, it could be better and now I'm really ready for final and you check it out. He doesn't have problems with the big tricks, the ruler flip which he crashed in Cologne was his first trick here. Afterwards, a fireworks of his most difficult backflip variations, six of a total ten tricks are flip combos from Libor. Here, a cliffhanger flip followed by a switchblade to switchblade, a new trick for Libor. Yo! Really nice, really nice. Wow, an amazing whip flip from Libor, currently the most tweaked out in the world. With all that, what's he saved up for the double up? He's already shown everything that we know from him. Yeah, ruler flip Indian, a high-end new trick from Libor. Luck for Libor also that there are mats and the crash was late, so the trick would be counted. Good points and he beats Massimo and takes the hot seat. Next rider, Bryce Itzo. We are all bad. Yeah, my qualification run was very good, but of course I will step it up in the finals with a Shaolin flip as a double up. Seed gap one in India and to Roxal and a new trick from Bryce. And I, it's perfect, I love this trick. Clave hanger. Shaolin flip, sweet, good, nice extension. Perfect run. Libor is so impressed by Bryce's run that he can't believe the judge's decision at all. Libor remains on the hot seat. And the next one is USA rider, Brody Wilson. I'm hoping to do a couple more backflips and uh, extend my tricks on the flips a little more. I wasn't uh, too pumped on those. But I was happy with all my normal stuff, so hopefully I can repeat that and give you guys a good show in the finals. Brody tries exactly that in his final run. Safe tricks, but really solid with some nice normal variations and then slowly approaching the flip tricks. Here he pulls a very nice no foot can can flip in the double up. Brody had a perfect run, really stylish as usually. Just maybe you need a little bit more flips for next event, but. Let's see what judges is gonna say. Judges, I hate judges anyway. I'm still here, I'm on a podium, dude. It's good, third. I look out, our Iceman. Let's see what he's got. All right, so I qualified in first position with, together with uh, Remy Bizuard, so I'm up next in the finals. Wish me luck. The current world champion has an unbelievable comeback with long and strong tricks like that beautiful Cordova flip. Big turn down whip, big one. Sweet trick. The judges give the current lead to the world champion, who never expected to place as well as he did. I didn't expect to be sitting on this chair at all. The second place is secure, now only one rider remains. Ilo rode pretty good at the qualification, and uh, now the final is coming, I'm gonna try my best and my bigger tricks. So watch out for the final and enjoy it. 
Remy says that with a relaxed look of confidence. He also rides his run like a man who has no worries. No trace of pressure to win both days on the way to becoming the new world champion. On the contrary, Remy focuses and his tricks are even cleaner, stretched even farther and held even longer than ever before. But can he hold this high level for a full 90 seconds run with 10 tricks? He can and he does. Just the double up remains, Remy has chosen the ruler flip the whole season long as his double up trick and nobody stretches them quite like Remy. Remy rode great like he did in qualifiers, he stepped it up a little a notch again, so um, I won't be sitting here for long, I don't think. A clear decision, Remy on the way to the title, new school freestyle motocross and dominant, 16 points ahead of the second place for the day. Oh yeah, it was great. It was way better than expected, so I'm super stoked. It's gonna probably gonna be a long night, but uh, hopefully I can do a skit tomorrow. That's my goal. I saw the, the Ilos run, and uh, I was like, oh, I have to, do, to go big tonight, and because uh, he's running pretty good. Uh, if I'm winning the second day, I will get the world title. I'm gonna ride and do like I do every weekend, and uh, try my best. On the second day here in Riga, we focus on Remy, of course. He can take the title two events before the series finishes, but first, it's Libor's turn. How can he can see me? Libor extends his whip flip in the double up and even threw one hand off for good measure. It's incredible how Ilo Gaup develops his tricks. He pulled a switchblade flip in the double up, which he's just learned in practice today. However, it wasn't quite enough to beat Libor. I count the points. I did it yesterday night. I have to be at least uh, five. If I'm fourth, third, second, and first, uh, I'm winning the, the, the title. Now everybody is waiting for Remy. It's clear that with his first tricks out of the box, Remy meant full power and no holding back for this run. All his tricks are dialed, styled, and perfectly finished. Absolute world champion quality. A clear decision, the win goes to Bizoir. Winning both of the Suzuki Knight of the Jumps here in Riga gives him the title of Freestyle Motocross World Champion. A really great day. I won the quality in the final and I won the world title also. So I'm really happy. I get a new car. Everything is perfect. I'm with my friends. I'm going to enjoy the time tonight also. So perfect day. He won all on last event, so for sure he is the real world champion. So the young beat the old. Congratulations, Remy, and thanks for watching Rebel TV. Take care.